always like to say to people, the devil is like a cockroach. He prefers the darkness. Hello there, everybody. I hope you all are okay. And thanks for watching another video here on Armor of God. And today I'd like to share a video that's probably answered a question I used to have. Where do the demons go to once they are cast out from someone? Are they destroyed? Or are they just on a run again searching for their next victims? Well, why don't I let Father Vincent Lampert explains this then? When someone is possessed, it means that they've created a connection with that demon. The rite of exorcism breaks that connection. It doesn't destroy the demon. Scripture tells us that they will roam the earth until the final judgment at the end of time. Yeah. But again, the Bible gives us very clear, specific directions on what we can do to gain victory over the devil. In the letter of James, chapter 4, verse 7, resist the devil and he will flee from you. The first letter of Peter, chapter 5, verse 8, your opponent, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion. Resist him solid in your faith. So the way that we defeat the devil is being solid and true to our faith. Again, we don't have to do anything extraordinary. It's the very ordinary aspects of our faith. And again, if we can recognize and always remember that the power of God is greater than the power of evil, the power of the devil, then ultimately the devil is nothing to fear. I always like to say to people, the devil is like a cockroach. He prefers the darkness. If you go into a room that's infested with bugs, when you turn the light on, what do the bugs do? They scurry for every crack and crevice. In yeah. an exorcism, the church is throwing the light of Jesus Christ on these demons. Go back to Beelzebub, the Lord of the flies, the bugs, and these things will scurry back into the darkness. They will flee. And then, so, unfortunately, they will look for their next victim who is not being steadfast in their faith. Well, this is all for this time. If you are interested to hear more of this live stream of Father Lampert, there's a link to the full live stream in the description box. Until then, thanks so much, everybody, for your support, and God bless you.